Jeff, well, uh, Ollie, um, what a way to get your first one of the season. Yeah, obviously it's been a couple of games in coming. Um, obviously it's good to get uh, get off the mark with a win at home. Not a bad way to, to, to do it in terms of your goal either. No, obviously the ball's come across and I've hit it quite sweetly and it's just faded into the far corner, thankfully. Yeah. Just a bit of luck that we needed. Yeah, and it, well, it, it, a bit more than luck, it was a decent try, but it, it came after a nice bit of build-up and, and you showed a, a real bit of quality in the build-up to that. Yeah, we've, I think today is probably the best we've moved the ball around and uh, that was obviously shown in the goal. We yeah. played the ball well on the floor and then it came across and I just struck it quite well. Yeah, and has that been a frustration so far this season? Because there is quality in this squad, but you probably haven't shown it as much as you should. Yeah, I think, like, We've obviously had a lot of pressure on us to start with and it hasn't gone our way so everyone's like, confidence is a little bit shot but we just needed to, we know at home we could like, have a good uh, home record and get ourselves going at home today. Yeah, absolutely and, and, and you did that frankly and a, a bit of pressure on you defensively, lots of balls into the box but actually as a team you dealt with that pretty well. Yeah, I think we put ourselves under pressure a little bit on our own back today but when the opportunity for them to get the ball in the box happened, they, they got it in and we managed to clear it and defend pretty well today. Yeah, and it was one of those days, other than the goal, where there were lots of chances, you know, Neil Trotman hitting the bar, lots yeah. of passes that almost went into feet, but it, it wasn't quite, was it? Yeah, there was a lot of half chances and a lot of small, sort of, if something could have gone a little bit better, then they would have gone in, but it's one of those days and thankfully scored a goal and we're got our three points on the board. Yeah, and, and did it feel a bit easier after that went in? Because from the sidelines it looked like you were playing a little bit more fluently as a team. Yeah, we, I think it brought a lot of confidence and I think we needed it to, to like keep ourselves going forward. But at the end of the day, it was just hard. It was hard work when we, uh, we brought the hard work on ourselves and obviously give them chances to get back in the game. Yeah, because some of the new boys really haven't had it. <coughs> but for yourself and the guys have been here a bit longer. The last couple of years have been a hard slog at times, haven't they? So it, it's trying to turn the ship round, yeah. isn't it? So we need to put consistency <coughs> together and obviously build our confidence up and we've got to maintain the belief that we can win games. If we are behind, we've got to believe that we can come back and win games. So it's just one of those things that will take time, but eventually I think we'll get there. Yeah, maybe this will be a first step, you know, a, a big confidence boost. Yeah, should do. Like, obviously, first three points and we need to improve our away record because it's not been good at all over the last couple of years, so that's something we need to look at, but hopefully we can do that and start moving up the league. I, I get the feeling there's no real celebrations in the dressing room, but, but a, a, a quite satisfaction of what's happened today. Yeah, there's not really much you can celebrate when you've got to be in training tomorrow and obviously the game Monday, so everyone's feet are firmly on the ground and we know the task in hand. It's obviously a bigger team on Monday and we're going to have to play as well, if not better, to beat them. But you've now got two games in the next seven days, haven't you? So a couple of positive results all of a sudden can turn a, a disappointing start into a, a decent one. Yeah, that's it. I think we knew in ourselves that we had a bad week and we didn't perform to the expectation levels. So today we had to put it right and we've done that and then it's on to the next game and then we'll do it from there game by game. Yeah. So obviously we've done 20, 40, well, 48 hours between now and, uh, and the next game. It's just a bit of recovery, isn't it? Yeah, it is. We've just obviously got a get the fluid on board and recover tonight and tomorrow morning we'll be in for a little cool down and then obviously Monday we'll be away on the coach and it's, early. Yeah, it's, well, it's not a very far coach trip is it but will you be, uh, be regaling the, uh, your teammates with your, your strike you can't hit too many better than that mm -hmm. you know? I, I don't think I have to be fair but I've always believed I could score goals and I always try but I think my composure sort of let me down last season and it's something I've worked on quite a lot actually in the last week so it's Thankfully, shown today. Well, it certainly did today, and that's, that's your third in a row of this shirt. I mean, it's double figures in the season. Is that a target? Yeah, definitely. The gap is te always telling me, like, you, you get double figures this year, you just improve that little bit of quality. And I, I know myself that I can score goals. It's just obviously like, keeping your head and keeping your cool on the pitch. And thankfully, today it was a bit of a good, it was a bit of good luck and a good strike. Well, let's hope it's a sign of things to come well done today, Ollie. Thank you.